Here we have our R and R weapon systems. IS44D-M, our 5.7 pistol, Pro Chrono Pal Chrono. It's about 70 degrees outside today at 10 feet. Eighteen forty nine, eighteen fifty nine, eighteen seventy five. This is R and R weapon systems. IS one forty four D dash M for Molly coating. Our five seven pistol, approximately ten feet, water jugs with four layers of twelve ounce denim. So here is our entrance on number one, went through the four layers of denim. Here's the exit on number one. We have two entrances on number two, one right here and one right there. We have the jug split open. We have the exit on number two. We have the entrance on number three. And exit on number three. And the entrance on number four was recovered in the fourth one. I did not find any fragments, but I was able to locate the base in the fourth jug. It's a pretty good sizable piece of copper there. Good penetrator too. Okay. Here we have R and R weapon systems, IS one forty four D dash M for Molly coating. We're going to test this out of our 5.7 pistol with the OE 4 and 3 quarter inch barrel versus 10% clear ballistics gel at 10 feet with four layers of denim. Impact velocity was 1,859 feet per second. Here's our gel block here. The base of our bullet almost exited the full 16 inches of the block. You can see the denim being brought in there. We have one, two, three, four, five petals. See five? No. Nope. Is there one? Five petals. There's a tape measure. Penetration on the base is right around 15 and a half inches. The petals are right around five and three quarter inch mark. And they spread the entire almost six inches of the block. That's a pretty neat wound channel right there. Expansion happens within the first, looks like, inch, inch of entry there. That's a pretty solid performing load.